Hello friends, in this video we learn about 2 plus 2 equals to 4 highest principle. So this principle say that one person is a maker, second one is a reviewer, one person is a author, second one is a reviewer. One person is doing something, second one is making sure the quality review. So this principle is applicable for or we can implement it anywhere in either IT, non IT, or any other industry as well. Or we can implement, uh, or we are using this principle in our day to day life as well. For example, my son is going to school, coming to, coming, getting his uh, like uh, homework. So while pre after preparing the homework, as a parents we are making sure or family member we are making sure, sure whatever he did that assignment or homework that is as expected or as per like whatever he got from like a school so he did that assignment after that as a parents or family member we are reviewing it so that is a his 2i and plus 2 reviewer eyes we are making sure that whatever is there that will be done either good or bad and if that is a bad we'll suggest hey do one more time make sure you are doing like that suggestions like that so this is all about uh for simple example in like in day to day now if you'll see that in uh, on any uh, real time example if you say that if you go and buy that a car in mirror tire battery and everywhere they will mention the test okay tested okay and something like that after that if you go and buy that a bag they will also mention that in one of the document this is tested whereas so what tested that means wheel, wheel is working properly chain is properly hand handle is properly and if there is no defect at all in in this bag as per that their company is tender lock is working properly so this is in non it we can say that if we go we'll see and in, in uh, it so in it generally we'll follow that like in all stlc phase for example if the we are doing the preparing the document so after that preparing the document we are making sure review of that document before getting the sign off after getting that requirement we are making sure that requirement is reviewed by that person after doing that some coding we are making sure the coding we are following that uh, coding rules coding is standard and after that that is a peer review is there for that coding for example i'm just taking one small example i have one eclipse project i'm in developer i just did that one java class like a hello all. hello finish so this is by default generated eclipse i'll just remove it after that okay so I just did that a code I'm not in that much of um, expertise in that but I asked someone to do the review so again uh, I'm only doing that review as of now as a different person just make sure so while doing the review I'll first identify that hey package is not their default so make sure just create that one package I'll just suggest that in textual or like in, in written written I'll ask him to put, put the package name package name to something like that okay and after that i'll ask him to put that this your class in package now it's look like a good and we have a, a structure we can say that decoding a structure a hello world something like that after say the hey whatever you have did that the 
you, you didn't follow that like and comment and documentations so class level documentations required for what what it whatever purpose is that examples method level documentations is not there default constructor okay after that I'll ask that hey method level this is also required and method. now seems to look like a good we follow that something this is like in a, a small example so with help of that you know now you improve that some code quality and we can easily identify that hey what this class is doing what this method is doing what is the purpose of a main method and why if you read write the some business logic he'll put the some more feedback he'll give that hey we had uh, we have this logic is not correct because it will take a lo long time for getting the output so might be the performance related issue might be xyz issue and likewise so if you think um, um, it may be the reviewer either your uh, like senior junior and your peer review peer reviewer so uh, while doing anything just make sure you are doing the review and making sure uh, you are improving that your quality so in next time to onwards once that developer will again he'll, he'll start doing that then he'll think hey next first time i did that some mistake and after that i got such kinds of a, a review so he'll make sure all those whatever he learn from uh, the time of a review he'll implement it so now he'll follow that practice as the practice or day-to-day -day activity then definitely he, he himself improving that uh, the things again he'll get the some more uh, like an uh, comment uh, like review comments or feedback then he'll try to implement it and in day-to-day -day he, he'll be used to so going forward in few uh, uh, sometime later he will be make sure himself it's like and whatever he is getting maximum things will be implemented but um, uh, he even though he'll do the some mistake so we have to do that like the cycles for all those phases for making sure like and uh, <coughs> we are in um, for improvement of a quality so i'll uh, like and as per my expertization experience i'll say make sure whatever you are doing that will be reviewed by that your peers and like in other persons definitely that will be improvement sometime there is like in a gap and disconnect now while people will not agree so in that time we need some mutual understanding for that for going 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 ahead of that this is all about in brief for for i for eyes principle hoping while watching my video you'll uh, uh you you like it and if really that video is useful for you please like and share it and don't forget to subscribe have a good day ahead.